control of chemical hazards, toxic chemicals and the four routes of entry. Inhalation of gases, vapors and particulate material, for example mists, dusts, smoke, fumes. Absorption through skin of liquids, solids, gases and vapors. Ingestion of chemicals directly or indirectly via contaminated foods and beverages and contact between mouth and contaminated hands, nail biting, smoking. Injection of chemicals through needles and other contaminated laboratory sharps. Flammable chemicals. Flammable and combustible liquids, solids or gases will ignite when exposed to heat, sparks or flame. Flammable materials burn readily at room temperature, while combustible materials must be heated before they will burn. Flammable liquids or their vapors are the most common fire hazards in laboratories. Oxidizing chemicals Oxidizers provide oxidizing elements such as oxygen or chlorine, and are capable of igniting flammable and combustible material even in an oxygen-deficient atmosphere. Oxidizing chemicals can increase the speed and intensity of a fire by adding to the oxygen supply, causing materials that would normally not burn to ignite and burn rapidly. React with other chemicals, resulting in release of toxic gases. Decompose and liberate toxic gases when heated. Burn or irritate skin, eyes, breathing passages and other tissues. Precautions to follow when using and storing oxidizers in the laboratory include the following. Keep away from flammable and combustible materials. Keep containers tightly closed unless otherwise indicated by the supplier. Mix and dilute according to the supplier's instructions. To prevent release of corrosive dusts, purchase in liquid instead of dry form. Reduce reactivity of solutions by diluting with water. Wear appropriate skin and eye protection. Ensure that oxidizers are compatible with other oxidizers in the same storage area. Reactive chemicals May be sensitive to jarring, compression, heat or light. May react dangerously with water or air. May burn explode or yield flammable or toxic gases when mixed with incompatible materials. Can vigorously decompose, polymerize or condense. Can also be toxic, corrosive, oxidizing or flammable. Some chemicals may not be dangerous when purchased but may develop hazardous properties over time, for example diethyl ether and solutions of picric acid. Follow these precautions when working with dangerously reactive chemicals. Understand the hazards associated with these chemicals and use them under conditions which keep them stable. Store and handle away from incompatible chemicals. Keep water reactive chemicals away from potential contact with water, such as plumbing, fire sprinkler heads and water baths. Handle in a chemical fume hood. Wear the appropriate skin and eye protection. Work with small quantities. Use up or dispose of these chemicals before they attain their expiry date. Corrosive chemicals. Corrosives are materials, such as acids and bases, caustics, alkalis, which can damage body tissues as a result of splashing, inhalation or ingestion. Also, they may damage metals releasing flammable hydrogen gas. They may damage some plastics. Some corrosives, such as sulfuric, nitric and perchloric acids, are also oxidizers, thus they are incompatible with flammable or combustible material. They may release toxic or explosive products when reacted with other chemicals. They may liberate heat when mixed with water precautions for handling corrosive materials include Wear appropriate skin and eye protection Use in the weakest concentration possible Handle in a chemical fume hood 
Use secondary containers when transporting and storing corrosives. Always dilute by adding acids to water. Dilute and mix slowly. Store acids separately from gases. Please give comment and suggestions. Thank you. Subscribe our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon for more updates. Thank for visit our channel. See you next class. Thank you.